Where do wealthy people vacation? One of the privileges that come with being rich and famous is getting to vacation in some of the most exclusive destinations on the planet. Having a healthy bank account and a well-known name means you can escape to exotic locations that most people haven't even heard of and be pampered in some of the best resorts in the world. Check out these luxurious destinations that the rich and famous always visit. St. Moritz, Switzerland. The place the rich visit to go skiing. One of the answers to where do the rich vacation is this quaint town. St. Moritz in Switzerland is an example of how the retreats of the rich and the famous don't always resemble tropical island paradises. One of the most highly acclaimed ski destinations on the planet, St. Moritz is located in the Albula Alps and was the first place to boast both the first ski lift and the first electric light. Not only do the rich and famous frequently vacation here, but it was also used to film a couple of James Bond movies, including The Spy Who Loved Me, Necker Island, British Virgin Islands, a Caribbean island that the rich enjoy. Necker Island is owned by billionaire Richard Branson, who is worth around $5.1 billion and is another one of those rich people's vacation spots most of us won't ever see. One of 60 islands in the British Virgin Islands, Necker is truly a destination for the wealthy. Branson has turned his island into an all-inclusive resort. Lake Como, Italy. Songs have been written about this destination. Made famous for being home to George and Amal Clooney, Lake Como won the title of the most beautiful lake in the world in 2014. Today, the Clooney's spend approximately four months out of the year in their $10 million mansion by the lake, Villa Oleandra. It's not a wonder why the locale is one of the most popular vacation spots for rich people. The lake is lined by several exclusive resorts, just in case you don't have millions to splash on a home in the area. The days here are usually spent taking in the colorful hillside villages, absorbing the local culture, and partaking in activities such as boating and golfing. Cabo San Lucas, Mexico. One of the reasons that the elite tend to flock to Cabo San Lucas is its natural beauty. The Mexican destination is home to Lover's Beach, which is straddled by both the volatile Pacific Ocean and the secluded Sea of Cortez. Not bad for one of the more isolated rich people's vacation spots. Cabo San Lucas seems exclusive since it's only reachable by boat. Var, Croatia, a secret escape for the rich and famous. Croatia is one of Europe's gems that many travelers still haven't added to their bucket lists. With more and more people flocking to see Dubrovnik after the coastal city was made popular by the HBO series, Game of Thrones, it seems that the upper echelons prefer the island of Havar. It shows up on many of the lists of rich people's vacation spots, far more than most imagine. Superstars like Tom Cruise and Giorgio Armani have been spotted living it up on the island in the past. Monaco, famous for casinos and Grand Prix, as well as opulence. Situated on the French Riviera, another answer to the question, where do rich people vacation? Monaco is one of the most famous destinations for the upper classes. Come here and you'll be met with an array of yachts, world-class restaurants, lavish casinos, and some of the best hotels on the planet. Bora Bora, French Polynesia, everything a rich person wants for a tropical getaway. Bora Bora in French Polynesia is one of the most popular destinations for honeymooning when it comes to the rich and famous. One of the most famous honeymoons to take place here was that of Jennifer Aniston and Justin Thoreau after their nuptials in 2015. They also brought along friends Courtney Cox, Chelsea Handler, and Jason Bateman on a private jet to share in the celebrations. If you want pristine views of tranquil lagoons and lush tropical gardens while mixing with the world's elite, Bora Bora is the place to go. And with that, we have reached the end of today's video. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you don't miss any of our sharp insights and tips. Drop a comment below. We love hearing from you.